everybody, I'm Brianna and today I'm going to do an unboxing of the August Goddess Provisions box called Treasures of the Tarot. Really love this box because I'm a tarot reader and I just think it's really fun to get unique tarot things and accessories and there's some really fun and groovy things in here and I'm excited to show it to you. So when you open the box, it looks like this. I'll show you the artwork for this month first. And it, it says, ask and, what's this say? Ask and you shall receive. Of course, it has all of the information that you need on the inside. And uh, it also has a picture here of some of the items in the box, which is really cool. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is the uh, Taro Fruit Blend Tea by Holy Santo. I really, really love Holy Santo. It's an amazing brand for witches or people on spiritual journeys. And uh, yeah, I just really love her products. So I haven't smelt this yet. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh. Kind of smells like fruit roll up. <laughs> That's really cool. And then also, um, a free gift with the Holy Santo tea is a tarot sticker, and I am obsessed with stickers. Hello. I've always been a sticker collector <laughs> since I was a kid, and uh, so they sent out one sticker with each box, and you didn't really know which sticker you're gonna get. And I got the Hierophant, and I had a feeling that I was gonna get the Hierophant, and uh, so it's really cool. I love how big it is. And on the back of the tea package is a QR code so that you can figure out more or learn more about um, the card that you got. Uh, so definitely go check that out. This is already so much fun. The next thing in the box is the air freshener and it's the star card and the artist is an yen art i believe i'm saying that correctly and it's vanilla scent and it, the artwork is so so beautiful and i know that the trading card pack that comes in this box is also by that artist and the artwork is just stunning um, so i haven't smelt this yet either hmm. yep smells like vanilla <laughs> just hang this in your car <laughs> or wherever you want, really. I probably won't hang this in my car because I don't like things swinging when I'm driving. So I might put this somewhere in my house, which would be really cool and really pretty. I just absolutely love the artwork. I can't wait to place this somewhere. So the next thing is the trading card deck. And I do think this is the last trading card oracle pack that Goddess Provisions is gonna do. Um, I love the trading card packs. I love to gift people one of the cards that reminds me of them or when I need to give a gift. I love to do that. Um, and so I'm really excited about these. I haven't opened these yet either. And these are so reminiscent of my childhood or just like your my inner child because um, I remember when I was a kid, I used to collect, you know, little like Harry Potter or Spice Girls trading cards and things like that. And my sister, I remember she used to collect like Yu-Gi-Oh cards. Um, so again, these are just so fun. And this trading card deck is the Major Arcana and they're so gorgeous. I've seen them online and I've seen photos and I just absolutely love them. The artwork is so beautiful, and I know that the artist is working on the Minor Arcana set, and so that's definitely coming your way from the artist. Look at this one, the Wheel of Fortune. So pretty. Black flies are coming for me. <laughs> the Judgment card. It's so beautiful. It's very reminiscent of the flower fairies, and oh, I just think these are so cool, so beautiful. I want to keep these ones for myself, so I might get another deck that I can start gifting to people, like give people um, a card. Also for all of the Goddess Provisions Oracle trading cards, um, we have a blog that describes the meanings of each of the cards in all of the trading card packs, including this one, the Major Arcana. And so definitely go check that out so that you can learn a little bit more um, about each of these cards and the past trading card Oracle decks, which are all still available in the Goddess Provisions store. They go perfectly with the next tarot accessory, 
which is this tarot case and it's very very cool you open it and it says ask and you shall receive and it fits a standard tarot deck like if you had the rider weight tarot deck or any other tarot deck it would fit in here and so do these cards fit perfectly my favorite deck that i use is the morgan greer tarot deck and so i actually don't have a case for that so i'm thinking that i'm gonna use this um, to house my main deck and it has these different symbols on it to represent the different um, suits in tarot so this is so neat and it's vegan leather which is really cool um, so i'm just gonna put my cards in here to keep them safe the crystal in this box is fluorite and fluorite's so pretty you can never have too much fluorite <laughs> it's just such a beautiful stone to have mine's kind of shaped like a rect or not a rectangle like a, a triangle which is kind of cool like a pyramid i love that i'm just going to read a little bit from the insert about um this raw fluorite it says clear negativity and embrace relaxation with this calming stone keep it near when making important decisions to maintain a balanced mindset note the stone is not water safe um, but you could place it next to your water so that the energy and the vibes um, kind of melt with your water, but don't put it in your water. It's actually a really soft stone fluorite and you can feel that when you, um, like if you run your nail across it. So the next thing is a, um, a scent. It's from a brand called October Occult. And I love that name, first of all. Um, feels like it gets me ready for spooky season <laughs> and uh, it's again the star so kind of matches with the air freshener a little bit and it's a clairvoyance mist and it says ingredients are rose quartz crystal infused full moon water neroli orange blossom jasmine flowers and sandalwood mm. Mm. It's really refreshing like in a sweet kind of way like it has like a fun scent like it's kind of fruity i feel like all of the things on this box kind of go pretty well together because this is the star card the air freshener is the star card but then the fruity uh scent of the tea kind of goes with the spray as well so the last thing in this box is really cool and it is a tarot mat how cool is this it's a it's a mini tarot mat so it's kind of like a traveling tarot mat and in addition to my morgan greer tarot deck i have so many decks like many tarot readers do but i also use a mini tarot deck as clarifying cards and so um if i was traveling i could just bring my mini deck and this mat and they fit like this could fit in the tarot case and so this is just like the perfect little traveling set. And uh, so it has purple, you know, the whole goddess provisions uh, on brand theme. And it has different symbolisms of the um, tarot suits. And so this is just so cool. I don't have a tarot mat, although I could use the um, scarf from the Midnight Garden box as a tarot mat. And I'm obsessed with that scarf. I haven't used it as a tarot mat, but I could. But this is an actual tarot mat. And this is by a brand called Access Your Eyes. And I do think that the um the ink is selenite infused and it's a little bit shimmery i don't know if you can tell but it's i really like that kind of shimmer again it's something that just is so fun and spunky and i love that so you can get all of these things and the box in the goddess provisions boutique so definitely go check it out you can get these items individually or you can get the whole box together which i totally recommend you do because it's a really good deal this box is worth over 130 dollars but it's 55 dollars us in the boutique and uh like i said you can give these things individually as well and i think i'm gonna get another pack of the trading cards so that i can share them with my friends and yeah this is the treasures of the tarot box you got a leaf thank you so much for unboxing the treasures of the tarot box with me and winnie I love you. Thank you. And I will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.